Come on, Cart, work with me now. Watch out, watch out. Coming through. Sonny! <laughs> Hey, y'all. Y'all gotta be careful sneaking up on people like that now. Not everybody can do this. What y'all up to this fine Saturday? I was just about to ask you the same thing. Just doing a little shopping. So what if we got on tap next? Maybe we could head back to your place, swim in your swimming pool, watch big screen TV, cook some waffles in your waffle maker, and shoot some hoops on your basketball court. Sorry, little buddy. I got a lot of stuff to do. We like stuff. I'm more the things, man, but stuff will work, too. I kind of need some time to myself. You know what I'm saying? Sure. Oh, you want me to lose goggles over here? No problem. No, little D. I mean, I need my personal space this weekend. I don't follow. I'm saying, my house is my little chill spot. It's the only place I get to have, you know, me time. You mean I can't come to your house ever, ever, ever? Well, I mean, if it's an emergency, then fine. Oh, man, do y'all know what time it is? No. Me time. Gotta go. Dang, I am so bored. Why does the whole world besides Sunny House gotta be so boring? Maybe we should stop sneaking up on people. Do you need a napkin, Madison? No, that's all right. I learned this from the kitties. You guys as bored as we are? Up till a minute ago, yes. I know. We could go to the pawn shop. I don't have any money. Me neither. Forget it. Haven't you guys ever heard of window shopping? I just said I don't have any money. How am I supposed to buy a window? Now just look at everything in the window and pick out what you'd buy if you actually had the money. This just in. We have received another unsubstantiated report that a yeti or abominable snowman allegedly now calls our own Atlanta his home. In our relentless pursuit of truth and ratings, this news station is offering a $500 reward to anyone who can provide photographic proof of such a creature's existence. Are you guys thinking what I'm thinking? Yeah, I want to buy that TV. Actually... If only there was a way for me to get $500. Why don't we find that Yeti and photograph him so we can collect the $500 reward? There's a $500 reward for taking a picture of a Yeti? Come on, y'all, let's find him. All I need to know is one thing. What's a Yeti? Bingo. This is a Yeti. And this is a Yeti detector. I built it out of spare parts for my dad's weed whacker and an old doorbell. We better find them quick before somebody else claim that $500. I'm picking up a signal. This way. You really think this thing's gonna work? Absolutely. It can detect any ferocious beast within 500 yards. These readings are off the charts. He must be right around the corner. Ah! What's wrong with y'all? You told us to meet you here to help look for some Yeti. Sorry. The machine thought you were a ferocious beast. Quit pointing at me. I think it's going to need a few modifications. I think I got it. I just needed some parts for my dad's power braking system. Billy fell. It's working. It's working. Well, I am getting closer. I found it. I found it. That ain't no Yeti. Oh, <laughs> did you say Yeti? I thought you said Nady. So no big whoop. Madison, weren't you paying attention when we had that little discussion about what a Yeti is? Um... Madison, were you playing with yarn again? No. Madison? 
I just gotta find that Yeti, y'all. Without that five hundred dollar reward, I won't be able to buy that TV. This is a an emergency. Oh no, you're thinking of asking Sonny for his help, aren't you? Maybe. He specifically asked that we leave him alone. Yeah, but he also said we can come by if it was an emergency. And this is definitely an emergency. Am I right or am I right? Oh, they gonna all be sorry when it's me who get that $500 reward. Hey, Sonny, are you home? Lady, this better be one serious emergency. So? What's the big emergency? No emergency now. I was looking for the Yeti, and now I found him. Thanks, Sonny. Hold up now. You ain't taking this Yeti nowhere. Oh, my bad. I'll just take his picture. <laughs> no pictures either. But how am I supposed to collect $500 reward if I can't take a picture? Oh, I get it. You want the reward. That's cool. I'll split it with you. No, Lil D, you don't understand. I'm helping Yeti here keep a low profile. I don't get it. Why are you looking out so much for this furball? Because this furball here saved my life. Years ago, I was walking to play a little gig for some mountain goats in the Himalayas. This was right before I fired my first manager. I was exhausted, so I just set up camp for the night. Turns out the weather was a little chillier than I expected. If it wasn't for the Yeti, I'd still be a sunny sickle up on that mountain. So naturally, I thanked him, and I let him know if he ever needed a place to stay when he come to the A, look me up. And here he is. But you see, creatures like Yeti here, they like to keep the world believing they might only be a myth. You know, for tax purposes. You know what I'm saying? So, gotta ask you to keep its existence on the low. Sonny, you do realize you're asking me to pass up $500? Not for me. For Yeti here. Give him the puppy dog eyes, Yeti. All right, all right, stop that. I can't take it anymore. Tell you what, Sonny. Maybe we can strike a deal here. A deal? Yeah. I promise not to tell anyone about the Sasquatch here. Not Sasquatch. Yeti. He can talk. Of course he can talk. What you think? He was some kind of wild animal? No. Well, how about if I keep the secret, you let me hang out at your crib and use all your cool stuff whenever I want? Or you could just do it because it's the right thing to do. Yeah, that ain't gonna work for me. <sighs> yes, sir. Big widescreen TV all to myself. This is the life. <laughs> Whoa! Yeti watch TV. Yeti love TV. Yeti, man, look what you just did. You gotta chill. <laughs> hey, what you doing? This ain't no channel. Snow, Yeti favorite show. Remind Yeti of home. Give me back that remote. Yeti hungry. <laughs> Sonny, get out here eating all your electronics. Sorry, that's my bad, because I took so long. I had to go all over town looking for that yak meat he wanted. Yeti no care about yak meat now. Yeti wants snow. What the? Yeah, turns out yak meat's kind of rubbery. Guess that's why next to nobody carry it. Yeti wants snow. But it's 80 degrees out. <laughs> Yeti want more snow! Whee! <laughs> Sonny, this Yeti really crapping my style. He ruining my TV time, my video game playing time. Sorry, buddy, but the Yeti my homeboy, and he saved my life. You're just gonna have to find a way to put up with him. Now, 
If you'll excuse me, I gotta turn my living room into an ice rink. D, keep it down up in here, man. I finally got Yeti down for it now. I had to read him 12 stories and get him a warm glass of mountain goat milk from an actual goat in the mountains. Sonny, you been doing stuff for Yeti all day. How about you take a break and the two of us can shoot some hoops or something? Love to, but Yeti gonna be up in about an hour. I gotta get that yak stew started. Seem like to me you done done enough for Yeti. I think he's starting to take advantage of you. No, it's all good. Don't forget, he saved my life. Besides, he only asked me to do one other thing. students. Sorry, I'm a little tired today, but hey, I still got enough energy to crank this thing up. Are y'all ready? And a one. Two. A one, two, three. A one, two. One sheep. Two sheep. Nick, hurt. No, no, I'm so tired. Just need a, a few minutes. Boy, Sonny sure was acting weird today. I wonder what's going on. Maybe he was out late searching for the Yeti. That's ridiculous. Sonny knows exactly where the Yeti is. Exactly where the Yeti isn't. Which would be at his house, the location where the Yeti not is. Yeah, he's right. Good point. Well, whatever's wrong with Sonny, it seems pretty serious. Somebody ought to do something about it. Yeah. What if he has to operate heavy machinery? <laughs> Pay for your pizza. That's okay. Eddie got it. Does anyone have change for a thousand? Sonny! Oh man, that was Yeti's dinner. It took me 14 hours to catch that fish. What'd I tell you about sneaking up on people? Son, you gotta get rid of that Yeti. I don't care about his privacy. I don't care about his secret. He's running you ragged. You can't let him stay in your house no more. Oh, oh, I get it now. Finally. You still scheming to get that reward. But no, son, that's not... Get the hungry! Now, I expect you to keep your promise, Lil' D. Don't tell nobody. Y'all, I know exactly where the Yeti is. That's right, I said it. The Yeti is staying at Sonny's house. You knew about this all along, Lil' D? And you didn't tell us? Sonny made me promise to keep it a secret. But this done gone too far. That furball is ruining his life. And what we standing around here for? Let's go get him and collect our 500 bucks. No. Then Sonia found out I broke my promise. But I need that money. I already bought a cougar on layaway. But if you made a promise to Sonny, why are you telling us about the Yeti? Because I need y'all's help to get rid of him. We're with you, little D. What's your plan? 
Yet it don't want there to be proof he exists, right? And everybody in the A is looking for that proof, right? So all we gotta do is help them find the Yeti. Then he won't want to stay at Sonny's no more. Know what I'm saying? I really don't. But what about Sonny? Isn't he gonna notice we are helping people find the Yeti? Y'all leave Sonny to me. <laughs> Too much foam! Yeti not like Barry! Sorry, Yeti. I forgot it makes you gassy. Sonny, I gotta borrow you for a second. No! Yeti needs Sonny! Oh, really? Because I need Sonny to help me in the studio. You know, so we can record a song I wrote as a tribute to you, Yeti. Yeti, Yeti tribute? tribute? Yeti like Yeti tribute? Yeti come play mean cowbell! No, Yeti, it's a surprise. You can't hear it till it's done. Yeti likes surprise. <laughs> Yeti wait here. <laughs> no, you might hear it in here. Make yourself nice and comfortable. We'll call you when we're ready. In the meantime, you can play with this ball made out of yak meat. See, Lil D, I told you once you got that reward out of your head, you come around to Yeti. Yeah, I got a feeling a lot of people gonna be coming around to the Yeti. That's a strange thing to say, but I'll choose to ignore it. Now, how about playing that song? All right, let's crank it up. I heard the Yeti was spotted near Stone Mountain. Really? I heard the Yeti was shopping at Underground Atlanta. Roar! There's no need to get catty. Well, that wasn't me. Then what was it? Wow! It's the Yeti! Get your camera! Roar! Hey, you, hands up. Got you, hands down. Hey, you, time's up. Clock is running, 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 running down. Running, 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 running down. Wait! That's it! I can't believe that it's not true! Wait! That's it! I can't believe that it's not true! Wait! That's it! Cause I am looking for someone like you For someone like you Cause I am looking for someone like you That someone is you Hey, you, hands up Got you, hands down Time's up. Clock is running, 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 running down. Whoa! Up, down, all around. Run, 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 run around. Up, down, all around. Run, 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 run around town. Cause I am looking for someone like you. For someone like you. Cause I am looking for someone like you That someone will do Hey, you, hands up Got you, hands down Hey, you, time's up Clock is running, running down You lit tracks and signs of life Don't be out of, out of sight Don't be out of, out of sight yeah, don't be out of, out of sight, because you know what I'm saying? My daddy always said, out of sight, out of mind. I told you this song's supposed to be a surprise. You weren't supposed to come in here yet. That tea. What is going on here? Uh-oh. Y'all better get out of my house right now. But we won't take a picture so we can get 500. No! And stay out. Look, D, did you tell all those townspeople that the Yeti was here? No. Do you promise you didn't tell all those townspeople the Yeti was here? I promise I did not tell all those town people the Yeti was here. I mean, rawr! I mean, rawr! Do you promise you didn't tell anyone the Yeti was here? I promise I did not tell all those town people the Yeti was here. Yeti no feel safe. Yeti feel violated. Yeti go home. You sure, Yeti? Yeti sure. Yeti confused by your world. 
yet he longed for his simple ways. I can't believe you do me like that, Lil D. I just lost all my street cred in Tibet. I hope it was worth your little $500 reward. I'm sorry I broke my promise, Sonny, but I didn't do it for no $500 reward. I did it because I'm your friend, and that Yeti wasn't a good friend at all. I guess you're right, bud. I should have realized this house guest thing was going too far when Yeti made me convert my exercise room into an alpine ski resort. You're late, you're late, you're late. So you ain't mad at me? <sighs> of course not. Does that mean I can hang out at your house whenever I want now? I don't know. Why don't you give me a night to think of... I'll take that as a yes. 